Don't already know, these are items unboxed during majors. And to learn more about them, I stayed right at home in America. Ugh, I'm not watching this. This stuff from behind me. What the fuck is that? Arrow? Who's Arrow? Was that him? Don't already know. Oh, my bad. So what's the rarest item in the game? One in 156. And although it's hard to calculate exactly what the odds are... Oh, the Gator skin! Australia. Um, it's zero, it's zero point zero 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 zero. M two four nine Gator Mesh. Except this one is a souvenir, and we have no idea where it came from. It's the one and only souvenir without an item description. Every other souvenir has this text explaining what event it came from, but this one doesn't. We can of course tell by the sticker that it's from DreamHack 2013, but that's all we know for sure. XUC is watching your video. <laughs> Rare skin in Counter-Strike. Let's see what he's saying. Is oh, so it's like a bugged item. The first souvenir ever unboxed, but we don't have an actual answer. However, we know exactly why our final skin exists. This is the No Star Karambit. Called that because it's Show the, the only knife without Chrome. this little star. And it also has a float of zero, the only skin without an actual float. And it even has its own Steam market page where only it can be sold. It was created by Steam support when they used to refund scammed items. Usually support would have sent the exact same item back Fun he skipped items. the intro support would have <clears throat> same item but while sending out the karambit they accidentally created a completely new item and there's nothing else even similar but of course Chat. every skin i mentioned is special for its own reason there will likely never be that's just kind of cool one. nitro because there's not enough packages and same goes for the bondic gold but we might eventually get those factory new crimson kimonos the 387 karambit or a lower float skin and we know that valve is not perfect so let me know which one you think is the rarest why did i miss a bunch of them yeah because you skipped it was unboxed today. And even before this was unboxed, I was talking about how the roll cage was actually the rarest high float skin. And with seven zeros. See, what's great about low floats is that they don't cap XQC. until incredibly Yes, I skipped the whole video. I just wanted, yes, I just wanted to really see the skin. Skins. And that leads us perfectly into the M249 Gator Mesh. By yes, I saw that as in the game. I, who linked it last time? Far the lowest float skin. I think it was like Zippo or whatever. Nine zeros. Yeah, nine zeros. Now, I mentioned the max signed Tom integer Flexer earlier, but stick. this is when it's Jay really important. All about knives. Bro, just watch the whole video. Why is he skipping? Rambit case factory new Rambit case art and pattern 387. We find that it's a one in 825 million chance to be unboxed. Hey, now, brother, obviously, that's the same so odds as the every other factory create. new case art. But this is the holy grail of blue gems, and there's only one. Now, on to floats. And if you don't know, this is what determines. I mean, dude, chat, that looks fucking stupid. Chat. How, how much do they need to buy this shit? Only one. Now on to floats. And if you don't know, this is what determines how good or bad a skin looks. Oh, on. Counter-Strike definitely does have a knife problem. We've unboxed 3 million knives, which is 1.2 billion cases. Most of which are butterfly knives due to being in so many... Guys, I said this a long time ago, Chad, and I'll say it again. I feel like there are things that are intended to hit on purpose. Like... I feel like, see, this knife is 1 in 825 mil, but we have this one, but there's only 3 mil knives open to total across all knives, right? What are the odds that that pattern, like, dude, it's like mathematically insane that you open that. Million knives, which is 1.2 billion cases, most of which are butterfly knives due to being in so many different- But all the cool ones are all opened. What are the odds that- out of all these odds, we have all the cool ones that are possible are all opened. It's really little. Cases and also having one all to themselves. And the rarest finish is the Black Pearl with only 217 of them. But why is that? Well, if you were to unbox a Butterfly Knife Doppler, there's a 10% chance for it to be a gem and a 1% chance for it to be a Black Pearl. On top of that is a 10% chance for it to be Stat Track and then a 1 in 26 chance for it to be Minimal Wear. Which means this exact knife that you're looking at had a 1 in 300 million chance of being unboxed. And with that, we're just getting started. If we use these exact same calculations on the fact- Chat! Unless I'm wrong, something tells me the, uh, that the, the odds aren't done like this. 
Chat, I feel like there's like combos of things or whatever. Because That's exactly wrong? how it Chat, works. I think it's very really rare you get like a stat track, bing, 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 and it's like battle scar dog shit. It's like, it's less often than the ones that are decent, at least. To be minimal wear, which means this exact knife that you're looking I'm at. I'm wrong. I, I, I'm losing it. I'm losing it. One in 300 million chance of being unboxed. And with that, we're just getting started. If we use these exact same calculations on the factory new Krambit case Arden pattern. Oh, it could only be minimal wear. Oh, but yeah, because I forgot because of the, of the cutoffs. What about this one? Also being the most expensive. While Bloodhound gloves are... And for that, I went to Antarctica. Oh, it's cold. There we go. Now, gloves are already pretty rare. With only 1 million in circulation compared to the 3 million knives. And something that I found interesting is that sport gloves Pandora's exist box. the most while also being the most expensive. While Bloodhound gloves are some of the cheapest and only 7,000 of them exist. But that's still a lot. So then, what are the rarest gloves? Pandora's box. These are the Tier 1 Max Red Minimal Wear Crimson Kimonos. This is a pattern-based skin, and it has five tiers based Ooh. on the amount of red that it has. And there are only four Tier 1 patterns that have the max amount of red, leaving us with only 11 Minimal Wear Tier 1 pairs. And it's so unlikely to unbox one of these that the factory new version doesn't even exist huh? yet. Next up are knives, and for that- Chat, isn't that because the cutoff for factory is so fucking high, that the chance of having the right pattern and that it's the high one is like, most impossible? The version doesn't even exist. Yeah, the cutoffs yeah. are super fucking Next high for gloves. Knives. And for that, I went to the UK be Which one is this? Anyways, Counter-Strike definitely does have a knife problem. We've unboxed three million knives, which- Oh, this one. Hundred times in souvenir, but due to the extremely small float cap for factory new, there's only one. And the odds to unbox one of these is incredibly <laughs> small. So the oh my days, this is hard. This hurts. Rare. Now on to stickers and chat. For this, chat. I flew to where they're most popular. What if you bought, go went back in time, chat, and you and you bought like like fifty thousand souvenir boxes and you held on to them, chat? You you would have been chat. It wouldn't have been even that much money. And you would you would be you'd be hardcore right now. So you would you would be hardcore. You could literally control the market and you could sell the one every every whatever at a good price and you would milk the market, dude. Whatever. What about this? What is this? Which is so hard to unbox and well worn. Just watch it from the beginning. Four times. Oh uh, whatever. That's a good video, I enjoyed it. Even though I accept it like a maniac. Alright. Chat, chat, these little chat always make me want to open some cases. I feel like, guys, guys, I don't even feel like it's that much of a... It, I get it, it's Gamba, but anytime I see cool knives, I want to open the fuck out of them. But oh I, my I, I, God. Open boxes and I get, I get bored because it like, takes a long, a long time to get cool ones. Why does he skip, bro? He could have actually learned about skins. I explain everything. I explained it all in the video.